Welcome back. This is the Horde bike that was part of that competition between the Horde and the Alliance. You had to log in prior to September 30th, I believe that was the date, for your account to be flagged to receive this bike. And Alliance will be receiving their bike as well. I haven't logged in under Alliance to see if it's there yet. But, this bike is, people were thinking that it was going to be mailed to them. It's not. It's already in your mount tab. So, if you go under your mounts, you'll see it is called Warlord something or other. This bike is so sick. And don't tell me that I was the only one making vroom vroom noises driving this around. This is, they did a good job taking that bike that was custom made in real life and bringing it into the game. I, I think they did a really good job with it. Now one of the things that I'm adjusting to is the lack of the sparklies. I may end up turning this off. I'm, I'm trying to adjust. I've been adjusting since beta. I'm so used to the sparklies. I don't know. Let me know. Which do you prefer? Do you prefer the outline or the, or the sparklies? I'm trying to work with it. We'll see how, how I go. <laughs> Character models. Some people love them, some people hate them. I don't particularly care for the Torn ones because her mouth is shut right now, but when you get in the game, her mouth is like open and she looks like she's smiling, which completely kills my I'm about to whoop your ass vibe. So, if you're one of those that does not like how your character looks, you can come into the barber shop and you can change it which is nice. Now, I'm trying to encourage people to get in here and do it now because I don't know how long this is going to last because this is something they could make a lot of money on. So it may not be here after the expansion. They have not said anything about it, but I'm warning you guys, get in, do it now while you can. And I hope they fix the torns. Their noses are huge. Oh my God. Ridiculous. One of the things that I love about being on a high populated server is that you never know what you're gonna see. <laughs> I have no idea why these trees are here. And the truth of the matter is, is that I don't care. It's just that it's nice every once in a while to come into this area and see something completely unexpected and have no idea why it's there. I have no desire to turn myself into a tree. I have no desire to find out. I mean, if you guys know why they're trees, please tell me. I mean, you can tell me if you want, but you know, I'm not so inspired that I'm gonna go and search it out or anything like that. It was just one of those unexpected things that I just like. I don't know why. Look at the graphics on this. This is the Iron Horde area, and I'm not going to spoil anything out here. I'm not going to do the whole quest line or anything like that. Um, but I encourage you to do it. I encourage you not to use a quest helper, because I've done this multiple times in beta. But they are available if you choose to do so. But I think you should try to immerse yourself into the storyline because it's ramping you up to what's coming next. The character enhancements, while I may have, I mean, I still have to go through it with the Blood Elves because they just jacked the Blood, blood Elves and didn't do it this time. So it could very well be that I'm going to eat my words later on. But I think that they were long overdue completely into comparison to things like Final Fantasy or Eve. I mean, hell, Eve is 10 years old and look at it. Why does, you know, I, yes, it's a different graphic style, but come on. So I'm, I'm glad that they, you know, updated it. And it's good to see, you know, the NPCs that you're fighting with have expression. You know, it's something that I've taken for granted that were in other games you know, because I felt it should be a standard. I mean, look at this. I mean, I, I haven't tried to create an orc 
Because if I still don't see brown skinned orcs, and it's not because of the color of, you know, that I'm a woman of color, it's that there's something in the game that I can't be. It, it, that's all that it is. And, and I've wanted them. Oh my god, it spins. The glass, the side of the glass. Oh my god. They spin. That is so awesome. When I saw them in the grand for the first time, I wanted one. And I haven't been able to get one, so I was sort of a little, you know, salty since then. So <laughs> that's that's all it is. I think that if there's an, if it's possible, it should be. And in the grand, we were good. You know, it wasn't like we were enemies. We were good. So yeah, uh, brown skin orcs need to be. I did see a brown skin alliance. I showed that in the video. It's like it, she looked rather homely, but she was there. So you know, it's about time just saying so anyway i'm not gonna spoil too much about this thank you for watching if you like the video hit the thumbs up button it lets me know if you like the video or not thank you for liking and sharing and commenting on the videos it allows me to do what i love and i would not be able to do it without you this is the gear that i got from the quest and uh the quest line you can get an estimate of how long it takes Remember, I'm familiar with it, but and I, you know, played around in the city for a little while. So this is what I received, and I will see you guys in the next one.